want is it? Um, sir, she's still here. What? 5 p.m. and she's still here? Didn't you tell her that I asked her to leave? I tried to. It's okay. I'll handle it. Hey, baby. I don't expect to still meet you here. What are you still doing here? But I'm not ready to leave. You have no choice. Okay, I'm done with you. So pack your things and get out. Dress up. I'll do transfer for you, but just go and dress up. Let me. Do you want me to kick you out? Um, hello. You know you can still leave. He'll still pay you. I believe I know what I want. Thank you. You never say no. Trisha, wake up, Paul. I'm going to work already. Trisha! I make sure you wash the bathroom. Oh, babe, let me be. First, you woke me up from a sound sleep. And then you order me to go wash the bathroom. Give me a break. Trisha, I will tell you to clean anywhere in this house. I'm the one that does all the stuff that brings money around here. So the least you can do is to make sure you keep this house that both of us live in and I pay for clean. Alright, no need to nag, I'll do it. Very good. Um, by the way, Mark was here yesterday. What was he here for? Babe, you need to give that guy a chance to prove himself. He's changed. Make sure you wash that bathroom. I am a dead. He's my good liquor. Big boss. Honey, she be not say you the owe me. I know now. Calm down. How far? Which manager they talk about our salaries? My sister. He say I can never sign no more. Now wow. And we're two weeks into a new month and our salaries have not been paid. My bills keep piling up and piling up. I don't know what to do. There this baby big grandma. Eh? No lady they owe. You know go they go ask those men. I did they go the link. Eh? You know because I did they go the link. There they ask me nonsense. They never finish the one way they get them. No, you dare they jack me for money and they owe you. I better go, girl. They see the drink down. Look at go. They didn't pay us our salaries like we expected. Oh, my. See, except a miracle happens, I don't know how we're going to cope in this house. We'll be okay. We'll soon be okay. Everything will fall into place. Don't be sad, cause everything will be fine, okay? I hope so. I'm tired. Like, what's, what's going to happen? No money. Oh. 
It's fine. Oh, cool. Hmm? Yeah. Let me get you your food. Okay. Come on, bro. Don't go there. Don't go there. Listen, man. Today is all about baby. Hmm? So let's not spoil it, please. I don't intend to. I didn't know Susan was his girl. But I told you, bro. You just like to have them all, don't you? See, we are not all like you. Meaning? Meaning you are just a self-centered and controlling guy who only wants everything for himself. Nothing else matters. And why would I care about what anyone else wants? It's not my business. You see? That's exactly my point. So tired of being around. What's the thing? Come on now, Ibi. You have not got into that. Come on. Abdu! Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, Greg. I literally begged you. I said, it's all about Ibi. Let's not ruin it. And you just did. Hey, don't put this on me. I never wanted to come here, but you made me. I made you? Yes. So you're saying it's my fault? Of course it is your fault. If, if I didn't come here, I wouldn't be here discussing about Susan and Abdul. Well, I'm not the one that wants to have every pretty girl he sees. Am I? You know what? When you're ready for any discussion, what are you, you just, um, you have my number, right? Okay, hold. I believe this can take care of it. Really? Greg! Yes, I'm so sorry. No, no, no. Me... It's, it's fine. I can take care of it. Thank you. Okay, please just take the money, okay? If it's no if, if it's no okay, I can I can just add add some more money for you, okay? Please give it to your friend. I believe he's your friend, right? Yeah, he is my friend. Thank you. I'm so sorry for that, okay? I do not want anything. Get me a bottle of energy drink. Okay, sir. Oh, oh. Daddy, how are you feeling? Oh. Are you feeling better at all? Yes, better today than, than yesterday. You didn't go to work? Oh. Oh. Today is my off day, oh. so I just came today to take care of you. Yeah. Oh. You have a life to live. Eh? Eh? I'll soon go to the other side. Eh? I'm not going anywhere. Don't talk <gasps> like that. Even if you have to go anywhere, it's not anytime soon. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, your brother is not helping. He's not. He's not helping you out. I'm not complaining. I I can do whatever he wants to do with his life. He can do whatever he pleases. I'm fine. I just want you to be okay. I just want you to recover. Just rest. Um, Trisha will be coming with food for you later in the day. You mean, you mean Patricia? Hmm. You always love to call her that. Yes. My late brother didn't call her a half name. Eh? You young people, you, you, funkify. Eh? Every name, eh? he should soon be trickster. Uh. <laughs> Stop. Oh.
What is this since? Hmm? Sales customers, they nobody attend to them. We make dinner, she no come today. No, they ask me that kind of question again. Oh, you come meet them for me, ask them to come collect. Quick, quick, oh yeah, fast, fast. They calm down. Come on, come on for your job. Nonsense. What can I offer you, please? Let me have a bottle of vodka. Would that be all? Yes, that would be all. Bottle of vodka. No, be short, so. If you like it, hmm? fall down for grand. Thank you. Hey, if I want you to open it, I'll ask you to open it. Sorry, sir. Bad G! <laughs> the Greg himself. Bro. Uh, hello. Where did you, How you doing? Doing? Where did you get this man from? <laughs> I lost my yeah. phone. <laughs> Nice guys, you know. Later! Hey. Bro, I'm good. Alright. So, yeah, what are you having now? No, what, no, just leave what I am having, okay? They will come and serve you yours. Leave what I'm having. Yeah. Look, I'm sharing you're always, you're always messing out with all these things, sir. Huh? Welcome. Um, please, what can I get you? Wait. You don't seem to remember me, right? I do, actually. You do? Oh, you have been having some mm -mm. I'm sorry, you, That's the only language you understand. See, listen. This is actually the same girl you knocked off the trail of her drink. That same day you walked off. I returned some money from the money you dropped that day now. Oh, actually I remember. The good citizen. Ah, Greg. Okay. Um, since you don't need anything, I think I'll return when you need something. Thank you. Um, hello. Sorry, I've actually made up my mind. And I would like to have you for dessert. Oh my How god. Oh my god. What's that? My dear, so sorry, please. I, I don't even know how I became friends with these people, okay? Please. Oh. The thing is, you will just get us another bottle of vodka, okay? Thank you. But I never said anything wrong. Why? What's your problem? That's what they are for. I've like, read shut no, up. So you want to you want to eat a human being for dessert. No. So you are a cannibal. That's <laughs> your problem. Yeah. It's my card. Come on, take it. Call me. Um, Greg. Yeah? You gave that girl your card. Yeah? Aren't you tired of all this? When is all this nonsense going to stop? I mean, that girl seems like a nice girl. Why? Because she returned my balance? That is besides the point. Okay. What I'm trying to say is that, aren't you just tired of all this thing? I, I have this feeling The feeling that you have is that you want to sleep with her and move on. There's nothing like any other you feeling you're talking I'm about. You know I'm not like you, first of all. Wow. I have my steady girlfriend. Yes. I'm just saying you should just stop. That girl, that girl is a nice girl. Don't aren't you tired of all this changing of women? Oh well, you said you are not like me. Which means um you are the responsible one. I am the irresponsible one. So you that have a steady relationship, why not enjoy your lovey dovey, whatever you're doing, and allow me to have fun. All I want is sex. Love doesn't exist in my dictionary. Okay? Wow. I'm so surprised at you, bro. You should, you should just give it a rest. It's too much. Stop all this nonsense already. I mean, not that girl. She why do you think you can tell me how to live my life? Uh, no, tell me. Why, why do you think you can, you can control how I live my, my life? Are you my father? Listen, you need no, to calm no, down. you have to stop. Don't tell me to calm down. No. Let this be the last time you tell me shits like this. Greg. You're honey, right? Yes, I am. 
I've been waiting for you like forever. Oh, I'm I'm sorry. I just finished from work. It's fine. So why don't you get into the car? Oh, thank you very much. I didn't ask for a ride. I can find my way home. No, no, no. I'm not talking about your house. I'm taking you to my house. Sorry, Mr. My name is Greg. <laughs> Mr. Greg, why would I want to follow you to your house? Like, even if I didn't have anything to do, why would I do that? Okay. Uh, I can see what you're, you're trying to do here. You're trying to be stubborn, but it's fine. So, how about um, you get into the car, I take you to my house, then you name your price. I am so sorry, but it's obvious you're taking me to be who I am not. Do have a good day. Why are you being stubborn? Most girls will jump at this offer. I am not most girls, Mr. Greg. Do have a good day. But you're still a girl, though. Listen to me, it's either you give Mark a chance or open up to another relationship that will make you forget the past. I don't think I need to open up to any relationship. I don't think I deserve to be loved because if I do, why do I keep meeting men that keep breaking my heart or hurting me so much? Don't give up on love. Don't think you're not meant to be loved. I love you. <laughs> Aren't you so cute? <laughs> Come here, yeah. Mm. It's okay, go. Have you made lunch? It's okay now. Just go and bring lunch. I think it's easy now. All right, I'm coming. Your Would you be needing any other thing else? If I need anything else, I'll tell you. Okay. Alright, sir. Now listen to me very well. I need to let you know that you are in charge. You are always in control. And no other person should tell you otherwise. Have you heard me? You're a man. Always stand your ground. You are always in control. Have that at the back of your mind. Every time. And yet again I say, you are always in control. Greg. Um, I came to say good night to you and to confirm if you need any other thing. I don't need anything. Actually, there's one more thing. you bring all the girls to the house when you have me I always can you stop Greg no well maybe you need to go and make me something to eat now So 
So, we are good with the bralette deal. All we need to do is make sure they meet up with your backing and, you know, submit the proposal of adverts on time. Well, from my own office, as the HR manager, I mean, I still have problem with the qualifications and the experience of these, uh, what's it called, the head of the creative department. I mean, this person is still new in the terrain. So, are you saying my recommendation is questionable? You see, I have to defend my office. Because when this goes south, everything will still come back and still boil down on me. What's going south? Hey, I have to defend my office. No, 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 I have to defend my office. Now, tell me, for how long have you known him? He's been working on this for five years. He's not a novice. I recommended this man and he's good at his job. Five years? Yes, so five years. You he have been dead. That, that shows that you people have been dating for five years because you are bringing your boyfriend in. My boy, can, 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 can you hear yourself? No, oh, you are defending him now. My, like, someone I'm working that, that cannot defend himself. Do you want me to start mentioning? No, mention him. It's not me that I brought this man here for me to bring him. Excuse me, I can't stay here. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hey, not be so. On the way we meet, on the get bigger problem. Which one we say we get bigger problem? You men, the only thing you people know how to do is to get in between our ties and put afterwards. That's a lie. A lie. We want women. We go feed, take care of our house. Eh? We get sense. We fine. But what do they see these days? Now, dumb baby, left and right. We don't like those kind of women, no. We don't like them. Na lie. We now know they check the right places. If you they check the right places, you go see better women. That's also wrong, wrong places when they go. Ah, mm -hmm. we they go long, long places. Where be the light place? Hmm? Don't tell me it's not church, yo. It is not church. Mm -hmm. See, eh? you can find a good woman anywhere. It can be at the church, it can be at the hotel, or even at the library. You can find them anywhere. To be honest, it takes a right man to bring out the best in the right woman. Okay, I don't agree, yo. But I hear what you talk. Hmm? You. But you know what you say? Uh, when I know you talk, say, uh, men know they take care of women. Men know they do this. Men know they do that. Men know they take care of women. When I will be with men, when I know what you want. I don't understand what you talk. Okay. Again, of my friend, he's a journalist. Mm -hmm. Again, what you do, they call him uh, opinion pool. Hmm? He said, they ask women, men, they mention five ways where they want me to have a they take care of them. Mm -hmm. So, what can happen? Mm -hmm. Out of 20 women, only two answer the question well. The rest, they say, um, I don't know how I want my best to take care of me. And I will come back later. Hey, God, it's quick. The question is, they don't know what they want. Una, maybe women don't know how now women take care of now. Mm, nah, lie, I beg. I don't believe this way you just stop. Okay, you don't believe me. Okay, no, I don't know. I don't say you can support your own fellow women. Yeah. Uh, see, I don't come. Customer don't come. Why so early? Why so early? Now you find come now. <laughs> now me in the fine come. You don't start. Now nope. only in fine come. I don't think so. Only. Don't be me in fine come. Now you in fine come. Now me want some again. I beg only go and say okay. Now me in fine come. Now me in fine come. Welcome. What can I offer you? I came to know why you haven't called me. I haven't called you because I have no reason to call you yet. Really? Yes. Okay, let's cut to the chase. I don't want to play any gimmicks. I want to take you out. What will it cost me to take you out? <laughs> Let me ask you. Do you have the phrase, I am sorry, in your world? Saying that I'm sorry means I've done something wrong. I've not done anything wrong, so why would I be apologizing? You are a bully, and I can't deal with bullies. <laughs> okay. Point taken. So I'll come by by 7 p.m. to pick you up. I am not available for 7 p.m. Be available by 7 p.m. Here you go again. Be available by 7 p.m. Please.
Yes. Um, hi. Okay, let's go. Something came up. I have to go take care of my dad. It's very important. Let me take you there then. No, it's not necessary. I'll be fine by myself, but thank you though. I take it that my apology was not accepted then. Come on, Greg, it's not that. But tonight's date can't work. I'm so sorry. It's okay. Take care. Yeah, just me. Just you about what? Haba, your dates now. You only called and said you're coming home late. I know it must be a date. It could have been any other thing, Trisha. Except it's not. But yeah, I'm listening. Okay, fine. So, I met this guy and he's a bit of a bully. I know how I feel about bullies. But anyways, he asked that I come on a date to him and I went with him. So, where did you guys go to? Tegan's Lounge. Yes, Tegan's Lounge. That's it. Hmm. The guy's got taste. He actually does. I would give that to him. But it's just that his friends, his circle of friends, they seem a bit randy. And I feel like he won't be any different from them. Look, don't be pessimistic about this guy. Everyone got a good side. Find that good side and work with it. I know you already. You're already giving up on yourself. Why you shouldn't open up? I will think about it. I've okay, I've heard you, Madam Cancelo. So you go out on a date when he asks you to? Uh, well, he actually asked. Oh. But I don't think I'm interested. Promise me. Promise you what? That you go when he asks you. She shall leave me alone. Uh uh. Please, no. Tri That's true. I need to go to bed early because of work. I have morning shift tomorrow. She shall leave me alone. Make sure you turn off the light when you're going to bed. Okay, I will. <laughs> Night. Hi. Hey, big boss. <laughs> Good evening. Mm -hmm. Which one make I give you? Uh, where is honey? Ah, 
Children are off day now. <laughs> Can I have a number? Ah, ah. What do you say you don't get a number since? If I have a number, would I be asking you? Yeah. Hey! Um, <laughs> the phone battery don't off. And I don't get a number off heart. Mm. So, uh, I don't know I won't take to that one. <laughs> I just remember, <laughs> I get another phone with the battery full. How many numbers here? Yeah, uh, give me. Honey. Take care. Yeah. You know, we say, come on, thank you. Hmm? Anyway, man picking don't make extra cash. <laughs> now, nah, eh, this bar self, now, don't you know? Oh, the person think this thing self. How person and person go to play Lovina, Lovina, and you don't get the person number? Nobody first thing they supposed to do. Hmm. I beg you, I want to consign them. We can clean this one. Oh, 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 uh, uh, I don't remember you asking for my number uh, or me giving it to uh, you. Never mind about that. I want to come and pick you for lunch. Uh, I'm not uh, available right uh, now. Uh, Nonsense. Tell me where you are and I will come over there. I'm at my father's house and I can't leave him all by himself. And why not? My father is not in the best uh, health condition uh, right now. Uh, Listen, I'll send you the best hands to take care of your father, but I will have to go out with you today. See, I'll, I'll talk to you later. I need to go. Wait. Tell me when we can go out again. Oh, Just I'll tell me. I will call you back later. I want. It's just a customer at the office. Mm. 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 Welcome, sir. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Welcome to my humble abode. Do you have a lovely home? Thank you. Then I won't be needing anything. If you say so, sir. Please come. So, would you like to eat anything? I can ask Nene to prepare something for you. No, I'm fine. Thank you. Anything at all. I'm fine. It's fine. So. So? Um, take off your clothes. What? Take off your clothes and put on this one. What? Why would I do that? Because I want you to do that. And I... They're nice, aren't they? I am not going to take off my clothes and I am not going to put on that thing because I do not like them. Hmm. No one has spoken to me like this before. Well, I guess all the women you've been meeting, they do not know what they want or what they like. I think I have to leave your house now because it's so obvious that whatever reason it was that made you bring me here, I definitely do not like it. Thank you. Stop. It's fine. We can do whatever you want, except, of course, leaving. And since you don't like it, I would um, call Nene to take it off. Nene! Everyone got a good side. Find that good side and work with it. You know, I really do not buy it when men say it's in their nature to cheat. 
but I'm sure you think differently of my opinion. Oh well, in as much as I do not want to be on the defensive, I cannot agree with you 100%. But I know you have your own views, so please share. No, I don't. I don't. Um, now, what do you want me to say? I don't believe you. I'm sure you know more about love than I do. Love? I don't know what love is. I don't know the concept of love. I've never felt love, never given it. So I don't have room for it. Well, I have loved and um, the very last man I loved shattered me badly. His name is Mark. You know, when we first met, he swept my feet away with all of the sweetness and kindness until I got pregnant he asked me to get rid of it but I refused but still I had a miscarriage and um, since then he never showed up okay he never showed up but at least he called no, he didn't call. Not even a word from him. He never called, he never showed up. I think my past experiences with men is what has shaped me to be like this. It's not like I do not want to give love. But I can't. Not anymore. No one will blame you. Not after everything you've been through. Is this the part where you kiss me? To get going. I didn't know time had gone like this. I'm resuming work today. Why don't you take an extra day off? I can't. Meg is going to kill me. Who is Meg? I'll pay her time straight off whatever it will cost to earn you an extra day. I want to go to work. I like to work for my money. I do not like the idea that you think that you can buy your way off anything. But I have money, and everyone wants money, so I have enough to throw around to get me whatever I want. For ulterior motives. You know, I expected you to apologize for demeaning my personality. How? Those words are hard for you to say, isn't it? What words? I am sorry. Thank you. Please. I can't be around you for so long, Mr. Greggy B. Do have a nice day.
Good morning, Greg. I brought some more milk. You can drop it there. I don't want anything else. He did not. I told you he won't. And I don't either. Oh, thank God I didn't make any for you. So what did you give him for lunch? I came back home and prepared fish pepper soup. Oh, okay. Okay, that's fine. Hey, he said they have juice for me. Oh, why are you smiling? Uh -uh. It's nothing serious. It's about that new guy, really. Craig. Yeah. What about him? You know, I um no, you are in love with him. Ha! I knew it. Trisha, I didn't tell you that. Take it easy. Honey, I know you. If you're not in love with him, you'll not spend the night in his house. Hmm. Fine, you're right. I really I really like him a lot, you know. Come on, he's good looking, he's tall. You know, but he's man. rich. God knows we need him in our lives. <laughs> we? You and who? Please, oh. The good is rubber for me now. And it also helps Pops to get a better treatment for his condition. You are so incorrigible. So you really think that I will meet a man and suddenly just transfer all of my body into him? Someone that I'm not even sure of dating. But you guys are not dating yet. No, we are not. He has such a bad behavior. He is so controlling. Someone that doesn't know how to say please, sorry, or thank you. Like, I can't even be with that person till I'm very sure he's changed. So how do you intend to do that when you don't want to give him a chance? Listen there. Give him a chance to prove that he has changed. You will cope. That is, that is the point. I don't want to cope, Trisha. I want to be happy. See, I need to go and prepare for work, okay? If you have something else to tell me, then it has to wait till I'm back. Mm. In case you don't need him more, mm. you can pass him on. And what's going to happen to Jesse? Uh-uh. He will leave. You are so unbelievable, Trisha. <laughs> Can I get you? Okay. Please don't leave me. I I want you to be mine. Be my lady. I really need to go now since you don't need anything. Please. I don't know what love is. I've never given it, I've never felt it. I want to be able to feel it. I want to be able to give it. Please show me how. Okay. If I have to agree to your proposal, then you have to follow some conditions. Number one, you need to learn to appreciate people. The way to do that is to sincerely say, please, sorry, thank you, where applicable. Number two, commend them when they've done well. <coughs> How long have you been standing there? Long enough to know that you've not been on a call. Rather, you've been talking to yourself. Give me that. Thank you. Uh, 
Um, Greg, there's something I want to discuss with you. Not now. Please. Remember the promise you made to me? <laughs> Happy birthday, son. Happy 18th birthday, my beloved son. <laughs> Dad! You're still really in the surprise, right? <laughs> well, that letter officially puts you as the youngest CEO in the whole of West Africa. <laughs> Come on, son, you deserve this. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. Ah. Dad! What audacity! I'm sorry, ma. Will you keep quiet and leave this place at once? Rubbish! Come here, come here, come here. Are you alright? Young girl, I don't know whatever it is you have with my son, but whatever that is, must stop. Now, today, have I made myself clear? Dad, I'll take care of this. He's already been taken care of. Now get out of here. Get out of here! Quickly! Just put it out. Can you imagine? Greg! Greg! You get us now! There's no point. We can't continue to be together. I'm the daughter of a man. He hurt your father. Let him say what he wants to say. Let him do what he wants to do. I'll do mine. We will be together, I promise. I'm the daughter of a man. <laughs> Nene, I care about you so much from the depth of my heart, Nene. Nene, I care about you so much. I've never cared for someone. Nene, please. Let him say what he wants to say. Let him do. Nene, I care about you a lot, Nene, from the depth of my heart, Nene. What's up, Nene? See, I remember the promise I made you. But I have fulfilled that promise. When you came here to apply for the job of being my housekeeper, we had an agreement. And there was no emotional attachment agreement. Now you accepted and we hired you. So I do not want us to continue doing this. Of course we had sex, yes, series of it, but it is what it is. Yes. I need to understand this for a fact that I am not the same Greg years back. Things have changed. People grow up. If you want to go, the door is open. I'll pay you off handsomely, but this cannot continue.
I am impressed. Okay. No, no. This is fantastic. This is a good job. No, 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 no. I'm fine with this report. This is impressive. You have done a great job. And I appreciate you for that. Uh, is that no, okay? No, 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 no. It's fine. I, I, I like everything that I am seeing here. It's, it's well detailed. Everything is, is good. Well done. <laughs> okay. This is, this is good. <laughs> this, this. And you all delivered in such a short notice? No, this is good. You know what? You can all go back to your office and continue doing the good jobs that you're doing. Continue making good money for the company. You can go back to your office. This, this is, I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you very much, sir. <laughs> no, I should be the one thanking you. You've done great. Thank you very, very much. You're welcome. <laughs> you can go back to your office. Thank you. We have to thank you, sir. It's all right. Thank you, sir. It's all right. Sir, do you need water? You I have. What? <laughs> thank you. Yes. Good job. Good job. Can I ask you a question? Shoot. So I don't know what you actually do. You come to the bar at times with your friends, and at times you come alone when you come to see me. What do you actually do for a living? Oh well, I am the head of an advertising agency. Um, I have interest in other ventures. Oh. Mm -hmm. That's cool. But, but you don't look it. <laughs> okay. There's supposed to be some sort of writing on the forehead, or are we supposed to look in a certain way? Is that what you're saying? I don't know, but you don't just look it. Okay. All right. So tell me. Tell me about you. No. Today, it's all about you. Okay. So, um, the last time we spoke, you said something about wanting to know how to love. What's your story? It's a long one. Very long story. Well, I took the whole day off, so I think I have all the time it takes. Okay, I I grew up knowing only how to be obeyed. I enjoy being obeyed. It's glorious, actually. It is satisfying. But as I grew older, I noticed something was missing. I felt incomplete. You know, there's supposed to be a balance. You know, a human being, a normal human being, should know love and hate. I only know hate. A normal human being is supposed to know courage and fear. I only know fear. And this is as a result of your childhood? Yes. My father taught me how to be in control. I love to be in control. I enjoy being in control. But as I look at people, I feel nothing for them. It's sad to know that um, 
I can't feel anything. It makes me happy and sad that I can't feel what I feel. Prior to now, I only see ladies as um, as a subject. Just like a, a worker who just need to obey me. I only enjoy their company or need their company just for sex. Yeah, but you, that day when you stood up to me and insisted on what you wanted, I was like, okay, who is this? And then I decided to take you as a challenge. <laughs> oh, I see. And how is that going for you? I just say I am um, I'm learning. Okay, that's a good start then. <laughs> okay. So what are you feeling like now? A teacher? <laughs> okay. Greg need to stay away from that girl. And I know you want that too. Of course I do. See, I have a plan. But I need your help. I need you to do something for me. Are you ready? Okay. Okay. So the money we don't want to come by NSC, 80,000. Okay. Ah. We don't want to. 50. No, 20,000. Okay. 20,000. And that money will just come. 15,000. 135,000. So aside from the money we barman will give you, mm -hmm. my account don't balance. Yeah. Yeah, that's everything. It is. Ah, <sighs> so, <laughs> honey, honey. <laughs> so, <laughs> so what, Meg? Why are you uh, laughing? You know one just me now. <laughs> Mama don't just me everything. <laughs> one young money miss road. <laughs> don't they fall in love with you? <laughs> <sighs> That bad man and amigo, see, don't mind him. I mind though. I see. You know what show me road now? I mind. He told me that the man they come here every day just because he won't see you. See, don't pay any attention to him. <laughs> Wait, come to think about it. It was him, not you. That did what? You haven't seen him, have you? No. I've not seen him. He only told me about her. By your young boyfriend. <laughs> your young bubble. So it was him that gave him my number, not you. So he lied. Huh? He lied that I gave him your number. Who lied? Huh? Who lied? Me are you for this place? Me are you for this? No go back. See, if you want to stay here, me alone they come on. Simple question. Who lied? People are not saying anything. No, no, no. You act as if you're perfect, but you're not different from every other girl that I've had. I'm so disappointed in myself for believing in you. Why did Greg say all of that to me? 
what have I done wrong this time? Do you think that I'm now beginning to fall in love with him and this happens? He's behind my misfortune now. Honey! Uh-uh! Not asleep! Why are you scare me like that? Hmm. Oh! Oh, did you, 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 they make all this nonsense noise for, for, for ya? Do go sleep, oh. Tomorrow now walk. Me no come to complain tomorrow, say you don't tire, don't tire, sleep, they catch you. You really know they like mind your business. I bet you, carry a while at the shift, they go. Ah, ah, ju, 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 until they happen. How will you just come here and say you want to see my boss? My boss doesn't want to see you. I don't care if he wants to see me or not. I would see him. I must see him. No, you won't. Who even allowed you through the gates? Eh? Musa! You cannot stop me from seeing him, please. Where do you think you are going to? You better get out of here before I call the security guard on you. Yeah, next. Sir? Let her be. You can go. You have gods coming here. What is wrong with you? I need an explanation, Greg. On the contrary, you are the one who need to do some explaining to me. About what exactly? That you were with Arinze and you were leading me on. Me? With Arinze? Yes. What are you talking about? Oh, you don't know what I'm talking about. Let me juggle your memory. Pictures don't lie, do they? I am not with Arise. It's not Can the you way you stop? think of it. Can you stop? I've seen that you're not different from the other girls. You need to leave. No, see, leave. I said leave! Now! Nene! It's okay now, eh? It's okay. Must we do this all the time? Eh? After all, Mark came back begging. And I told you to consider him. <laughs> ah? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. I won't call Mark again. It's okay, eh? It's okay. <laughs> Trisha, I'm tired. I'm sorry, it's okay, eh? You hold yourself by crying too much. It's okay. Mm? Don't I'm cry so again. Don't cry. I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> You need to leave. 
We just have... Nene, you need to leave. Please. I can't continue doing this with you anymore. Please. See, Greg. I know you think you have feelings for the new girl. But trust me, you eventually get over her just like the other ones. I don't mind you having your way with her. I will definitely be patient. No, Nene. Greg. You need to leave now. Okay, let's meet at our usual point. All right, see you there. Sorry, uh, I should have listened to you whether you had anything to do with her, Inze. It's not a problem. It, it doesn't matter now. I... I missed you. Okay, I, I can't function well without you. I, I can't even imagine my life without you. Please. I want to be a better man. You are the one who has been showing me how. Please, I really want to know how. He's a nice young man. I think he's a good man. Accept him. Accept him. Are you Please. sure? Yes, sweetheart, go on. Accept him. Go on, sweetheart, go on. Go on. Eh? Are you sure? I am. Go on. I feel it. Thank you. You know all the good qualities in me. It's courtesy of you, so... I don't know better. But you were here, I... Definitely will. What is the meaning of this nonsense? I couldn't help myself in destroying it. It's part of me just like your father. I thought we talked about this and you agreed to forget. Greg, you have to let her go. Excuse me? Nobody will love you the way I do. I, I, I've accepted you the way you are. I don't want to change you. You're perfect the way I want you to be. And that makes me and you inseparable.
Jesus are you talking about? You see, this is in the past. Let it remain there. You promised to forget your st You know what? I think Honey was right. It's time I let you go. Every night I wait for you. But instead, you bring all the ladies to take my spots. I've been understanding, I don't complain. I've been patient with you. And yet, she just come and take you away from me for good. Put yourself in my shoes. How would you feel if the love of your life leaves you for someone else? You are not the love of my life. Neither am I yours. Craig. Craig, tell me you don't want this. Tell me you don't want me. Huh? Craig, I love you. I do. Get a grip on yourself. You need to stop this and face reality. What is... You know what? I can see that you do not want to forget. You do not want to move on. Your appointment is terminated. Start packing your things. Oh no. Greg! Greg! Hey. Um, you're back? Yes. The admission process didn't take as much time as I expected. Oh, oh nice. No. So, um, <clears throat> that's good. Yeah. Um, where were you? I... Um, I, I was trying to clean um, in this room, uh, you know, cleaning it up since you're going to be a student again, so you might be needing it for your study. Mm. But she can do that herself, and I don't remember me telling you that I needed to use her room for the study. Oh, yes. Um, uh, that's not a problem. Uh, we can just um, convert it to anything else. But that's not important. What is important is that, um, I, I mean, your studies. Let, let's go talk some more about about that. Arizay, nothing seems to be working the way it ought to. Isn't it obvious? Hmm? What is actually between those two is love. I mean, who could have thought about my friend Greg? A popular playboy, a control freak, will be softened by a, an assuming girl like Fina. Please just stop it. Stop it. You were supposed to stick to the plan. But what did you do? You allowed that strange, that, that strange girl take Greg away from me. Well, she's no longer a stranger, is she? They are in love. But I love him too. You don't love him, Nene. You don't. You are just obsessed with him. Uh, not even in a good way. Is that what you think? You have no, you have no idea how much I love Greg. Listen, nonetheless, Greg doesn't feel the same way. You just have to let go. Just allow Greg and and Honey just enjoy their happiness, and you will find peace. I know it's difficult, but the best decision for you to take now is just to let them be, leave them alone. Okay? Just leave them alone. <sighs> hey. Hey. I'd like to discuss something with you. Okay, shoot. It is about Nene. I, I overheard you two's discussion earlier today. I listen. I promise a. Eh? Okay, I have to be honest with you. Whatever we had was in the past and 
I was young, I was in my 20s and... I'm not asking you to explain to me. I just want to know what your plans are, because right now it is unwise for you to have her around here. I am uh, handling it. I don't know. I, if you ask me, I don't think it's supposed to be so difficult. Considering that you have the means, you could just set up a new business for her somewhere far away, you know, in a different city. I'm sure with time she will forget about everything and move on with her life. But I just need to be sure that the past is what it is. The past. I promise what we had was in the past and it will remain there. I love you. I love you too. Let's go to bed. Sure. Are you still working? Oh uh, no, don't worry. I have more important. you told me last night. Okay. You're correct. She can continue staying here. So I've decided to let her go and um, give her this check to start up a new life somewhere else. Hmm. That's a good start. I'm sure with time she'll be able to forget about everything leave it behind her and she'll be able to move on from it i hope so so i want to go to her room and give her this and um i also want to do you want me to come with you don't worry i'll handle it what is what is going on? Where are you going? Greg, I'm leaving. I'll always love you. But it's obvious you don't love me anymore. And I can't force it on you. You made it clear that everything we had was in the past. So why will I hold on to the past? It's hard, but just have to let go. Where would you go? What would you do? I have made few plans already. Okay, but at least take the check. It's enough to help you start life anywhere in the world. Greg, I'm sorry I'll have to reject this. Thanks for the gesture, but goodbye. It's okay. I'm sure she'll be fine and she will find happiness. It's only a matter of time. Yes. She's a good person, she will. Babe, 
What's the occasion? You. You are the occasion. You have added so much color to my life, I don't even know what my life would have looked like without you. Unlike many others, you cared. You showed me exactly what love should be. You personified love for me. And I am grateful. You, you're my strength and weakness. Sometimes it scares me to imagine my life without you. Can't even think of a day without you by my side. And that's why I want you to do me the favor. Make me the happiest man and say yes. I know I am not. Yes, babe, yes. <laughs>